Hey guys, welcome back. Um, I'm in a tiny different setup this week. I'm not like facing the camera, I'm through the mirror. And the reason for that is we are doing a bedroom tour. So I thought I'd like reversing the camera back and forth. I might as well just do it like this. So yeah, um, you can see my bedroom behind us. I'm in a very different background today, as I say. So before we start, I'm going to do a quick outfit of the day. I've just been sat around lounging, done a new blog post, so I'll link that down below. Tidied up my room before I filmed because I didn't want it to look like an absolute pigsty. So I've just shoved on anything. So this top is from TK Maxx and I bought this two years ago and it's just old, just a nice slouchy top. Then my new jeans I bought Tuesday and these are from Primark and these are the super skinny ones. And then finally my slippers which are also from Primark because my feet get super super cold. So yeah let's begin so this is where we first come in here so we'll start off in this corner so this is the panned view of my room wardrobes bed bedside cabinet window which lets in a hell of a lot of light and then my area here so we'll start over here first now i have done a makeup organization and skincare which is which i'll link down below as well so I'm not going to go too much into depth about this little section here but this is where I spend most of my time um, I have my laptop which is in the corner so I, I always put my laptop here my iPad on the side and just do admin work from here emails, blogging stuff, editing videos, makeup I spend a lot of time on organising this and it takes the mic so this is also my mirror which is also in the video, so I'm not going to go too much into depth on any of this. Makeup organisation down there, chair, dressing table is from Argos and was £40. I'm going to like go through all my big items of furniture. My beautiful, I think this is 42 inch, and I love this, oh god, that is disgusting. The dust, is it going to focus? Oh, that's just disgusting. So I use this telly on a nightly basis, it's just always on in the background. Even when I'm watching YouTube videos, this is always on. No matter what happens, it's always on. Same as the fairy lights, these are always on. Then, I think we bought this from Kay's catalogue, I think. About three years ago, so it's quite old, but it just serves a good purpose. DVD player, got it for a present, so I'm not sure where it was. It's just a simple, is it Toshiba? Yeah, that's a Toshiba and that's a Murphy. This is going to get quite boring, so bear with us. Um, my chest of drawers. I actually have the chest of drawers and then my bedside cabinet are from the same brand. And my old wardrobe is from the same brand. And we also bought this from Kay's catalogue again. The bottom drawers open. So yeah, I, I got that set. Then when I got the new wardrobe, that went into the spare room. So I use this, to st the top drawer is my what's in the top drawer I'm, actually, I'm not going to show you because it's a mess at the minute it's my scarfs jewelry and accessory drawer middle drawer is just like uh, books magazines that i don't read just goes in there and the bottom drawer is for blankets my voice went a bit funny there sorry and as i said the bottom drawer is for my blankets because it gets really cold in this room then my large window which lets in a hell of a lot of light but I had to close them because it would be too much light. Then in my on my bedside cabinet, TV remote's boring. Lamp is from Asda, I've had this for quite a few years and this is on my dressing, on my bedside cabinet pride of place. This is, this was my invitation to the Vivian Westwood tea party which was held on the 1st of May. Now, as you all know, because I bought a Vivian Westwood bag last month, um, I actually went into the shop and I got this given to me as well, with me being a Vivian Westwood customer. But unfortunately, I couldn't attend because it was a bit late at night. But I've seen loads of photos of the night, and it was just such an honour to be invited to like an event. It was, I'm pretty sure like every customer who shops there got this invitation, but it was quite special. I've never been like invited to any parties or anything before. Yes, I am a loner. Hashtag loner. So yeah, dressing table as I no not dressing table. Bedside cabinet as I said was from the same as my chest of drawers, which is from K's. 
Walmart. Now, my wallpaper is very, very special. I love this wallpaper. I think about six months ago, so last year, I was really wanting to redecorate this whole room. Because ever since I started working, I just wanted my bedroom to look more like grown up and more sophisticated. So I decided to choose this wallpaper in the end, and this is from Wilkinson's, I think. And we only done the one wall because it would have looked a bit too much, but it quite, goes quite nicely with the wallpaper and everything. Right, onto my bed. I don't know what bed it is because it's really old and it's about knackered. So, yeah. The bedding is from Asda. And I got this to go with the wallpaper, so it's like a paris -y theme, if you, if you get what I mean. So it says boudoir Paris on the pillows and the quilt. Scatter cushions are from Asda. And this fairy blanket is, oh, it's so soft. This has been like in every, every room in the house nearly, because I use it everywhere. This we actually got off my uncle who lives in Australia. So if he's watching, thanks Uncle Ash. And I have a little guest on my bed. He's called Mickey. I bought, actually bought him last year for a treat just before Christmas and he was, oh my god, he's so soft and he's just cute, just his only bed. He's like practically garden my bed, which is quite strange. Right, into the corner, this is my, another lamp from Asda again, I have two, because I quite like, I prefer lamps and fairy lights to harsh lights because it looks so much more cosy. Right, this baby boot case is from Argos, I think. Now as you can tell I have quite a few DVDs, box sets along the bottom, DVDs, DVDs and then a little pot with a lip balm in which I'm not sure why it's there for. Then all my hair gel, it's like hair gel, deodorant, aftershave, hairspray. I'm actually going to pick out a favourite aftershave of the moment which is this one. I actually bought this when I was in Manchester last month and this is Bleu de Chanel. It's just a very very masculine smell and it's just actually everybody who I've shown this to friends and family and they've smelled it they're like Ryan that is just that's just like you in a bottle and I'm like well so I really like that it's quite it's really me because all my fragrances are quite like tailored to me because I quite like quite musky and heavy fragrances the one million is a very good one as well but that's more for winter then I have my two storage boxes with um what's actually in these like just different books i have quite a lot of books i used to read a lot but i don't do now books um unopened skincare bits that's just been forgotten about and these are from where were these from wilkinson's i think they were from wilkinson's but you can get them from basically anywhere so yeah these come in really handy and they're quite uniformed to the room laptop is down the side which stays down the stairs then this is my collection of Vogue magazines. I think this is like a year's collection. Yeah, just over a year. So every month last year, I bought a Vogue magazine and I was in love with them. But now I'm into more makeup and skincare, so I don't often buy them as much. Then my calendar is Audrey Hepburn. I love Audrey Hepburn. I love breakfast at Tiffany's. I love everything about that. So every month I get a beautiful picture of Audrey and that's just so nice and then when the calendar runs out I'm actually going to keep this oh it's dropped I'm actually going to keep this photo of her so it's just, just so cute and lovely right that calendar is just going to be thrown in the bed right then we come to my enormous wardrobes this is a two four six eight drawer wardrobe so no eight door so we have four large doors and then four drawers at the bottom and this is again from K's catalogue because we can buy, when you buy things from K's you can pay them in instalments each month so this was like £600 and I only get paid about £500 a month so I was like yes I want a big wardrobe then above here is just, I'll take you through it um, that's just something I've thought about to me totally to buy suitcase because I'm going away soon Phoenix shopping bags, uh, soap and glory bag and then these in here these are all of my like shopping gift bags like Orjon, Phoenix, Chanel, Dior. So like any time it comes to a Christmas present or birthday present and I buy something from, oh there's me, and I buy something from Chanel or Dior then I just use them. So um, 
I was actually going to go into my wardrobe but I might leave that for another video so yes we'll go back to the mirror so I hope you enjoyed this video and, and I, I hope you've liked the way I store everything like different things in my room I haven't actually took you into anything yet because I want to do that for next video so watch out for my next video which is going to be my wardrobe tour which I'm so nervous about because I have too much clothes to count but I'm looking down here on a one. But I hope you enjoyed this video as I said. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below what your bedroom looks like. Like a description of what your bedroom is. Um, I'll link my Facebook page and blog down below. And I shall see you next time. Love you so much. Thank you so much for your support. And I shall see you soon. Bye.